All right, so we got a muskrat here. We're gonna be skinning them out, fleshing them and stretching them. So the first thing I did was put the tail in the vise. So I'll, I'm gonna take my knife. I'm gonna go from the heel up to the tail. And go up to up through the tail a little bit too. Do the same to this side. Go from the heel right up to the side of the tail here. Now what I'm gonna do is grab the fur between the two cuts, put the knife underneath the fur, and cut up the tail a little bit. Leave about like a half inch piece of the tail on, because that's where your stretcher will hook up to. Do the same to the back. Your knife between the fur, go up the tail a little bit. Now you can just start by pulling this all down to the back legs. Get the cut this a little bit. Get started. Do the same to the back. Right at this, get it started with a knife, and then the rest you can just pull by hand. Now what I'm gonna do is put my finger through. So I got one finger through the leg and then the other finger's pulled onto the fur. You don't need to cut this part, just pull it straight off. So I'll do that same thing to the other. Put, put my finger through and then just pull the fur off. And I'll just start by pulling this down. You want to make sure that the stomach doesn't come with the fur when you're pulling it down because sometimes it will stay hooked to the fur and you'll just pull it all the way down with the stomach on. Also be careful because if you pull too hard, you'll pull the tail right off. So I'll get to the front legs. I'll do the same thing I did with the back ones. Put my finger through and just pull it off. You don't need to cut it. Do the same to the other leg. All right, so now we'll be getting to the head here. So I'll take my knife. Just start cutting up the whole, all the membrane that connects the skin and the hide. There, I cut one ear, just, there's another ear, it'll cut straight down. Now we come into the eyes. Here's an eye and here's an eye. So be careful with those, you don't wanna cut them too big open. That one looks good. And that one looks good. So now I'll begin to the front jaw, or the jaws. Just cut it all the way down. Just keep cutting all the way around. And when you get to the nose, just cut straight down. And then you got a finished skin rat. So now we'll go on to flushing this, and then we'll put it on a stretcher after we're done flushing it. All right, so I got the muskrat on the board here. I'm gonna start by flushing them. I'm just gonna be using a necker. All you'll need is the doll side. You don't really need much. You don't need to do much for when you flush out a muskrat. So now I'm just gonna put the head up against the board. I'm gonna lean against it. You'll have some cheek meat on both sides. You'll have a little bit beyond underneath the shoulders and a little down at the end of the hide, but that's about it on a muskrat. Pretty easy. Just scrape this off. You don't want to scrape off this, all this membrane. You want to leave that on. Just scrape off mainly the fat and the big chunks of meat.
sit on that side, flip it over. Same thing, get this cheek meat off. You almost always have some cheek meat on. It's kind of hard to do it on a big beam like this. If you had a muskrat beam, it'd be a lot easier. Get this meat down at the end of the hide here off. Meat and fat. Flip it on the back, see if there's anything. Not really anything, I'll just run it down once. Flip it over to the belly. Not really a whole lot on here either. Be careful when you come down to like this area because it's easy to rip it if you can't get it off with the flushing knife you can just get it off when you put them on the stretcher all right so that muskrat is all stretched or all flushed up just make sure you leave this membrane on it's called the saddle you don't want to scrape that off or you'll get a lower quality grade on your fur. So now we'll put them on the stretcher. All right, so I use wire stretchers on my muskrats. So I'll just take my muskrat, start by getting them on the stretcher. I'll squeeze the stretcher with my hands like this, and then that'll be easier for you to get it onto the stretcher. Just work it down center it where the lit the feet are centered. Make sure that you keep the nose on top of the stretcher there. Stop on top of the wire. So now I got them pretty centered, pretty decent like that. Now I'll take one of my my hooks here, and that's why you leave the tail piece of the tail on. I'll hook it onto the tail. These aren't real sharp prongs, so I'll put a little slice in this tail to get it started. So that's something to hook on to. So I got one on, pull it down, fairly tight, go to the other side. I'm gonna cut this one a little bit too. Pull it down. Now you wanna do is go around, make sure you don't have any fat on the edges. I got a little bit here you wanna Trim that off, or just pull it off. Here you'll have the, this is the butthole here, so you'll want to trim that off. It'll be a little blob. So, I'll just take my knife by holding that, trim that a little bit. And if you have problems with the top of the nose pulling off, you can just take a, a clothespin and close and put it right on the end of the nose. Sometimes you'll have to do that to some of your muskrats, but this one's staying on. But so that's how you skin, flush, and stretch a muskrat. So now I'll just hang this up for a few days and then it's ready to be sold to the auction or your local buyer so thanks for watching please subscribe